it's me again it's Francis so today we're going to do a bit kind of a I suppose a bit Christmassy wintry kind of thing I'm going to use this pine cone it's only small and I've just realized this is actually quite big because it's an album um, and it's on a swirly whirly now you can see I've already prepared it in white um, and interestingly enough I saw um, the other day somebody was using just normal white house paint so I'm trying that um, who knows how that's going to work out anyway we're going to give it a go so I'm just going to do it a, um, a ring pour over the top so we're going to get the paint in here I've got just random colors today uh, no <laughs> not that one not that random okay so but yeah it's perhaps a bit different colors for what what I'm kind of used to um, and I think we might do this fairly light this one so a bit more this is proper white that's not um, house paint white purple is always good purple I think has always been a bit of a favorite color I have to say a bit more white uh, what's your favorite color please put it in at the bottom um, but then colour, I think colours vary, don't they? At the moment, I'm also really liking the, this. in fact, I'm going to put some now, the, this bronze. The, sorry, the copper. Um, yeah, it's really pretty. Um, but I also like turquoise. That's a bit of a firm favourite, for obvious reasons. Sea reasons. I don't think anyone needs that explaining. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's see what happens when I pour all this on and make it a bit Christmassy. I don't think these are particularly Christmassy colours. Better put some more green. That always makes it Christmassy, like a tree. Okay, let's see what happens. I think that's, that will probably be enough. If not, I can always add more. So we just put that in the middle and then we're, we're good to go, I think. Okay, off we go. Oh, this may tip over. <laughs> oh, it's moving. It's moving. I'll do it this way. I'll hold it. No. <laughs> That's not working at all. Well, it's, it was a bit of a wonky one. Let's move it this way to make it wonk this way. Don't be on word. To wonk. And then a bit this way. That's an interesting pattern. Very intricate. There we go. Now, I think I've got most of this covered. Let it kind of seep out a bit. Um, I might do this, voice not one not. So much colour, it's quite, um, I think some people would call that muddy. Um, yeah, it is quite muddy. I don't know why that is, is it because of, there we go. There's the pine cone, it's not particularly defined. I think it's because I kept having to twirl it round. Anyway, so we're going to try and spread this paint. I thought we would try and spread it with the with my turntable thing. So let's see if that works. I'm probably going to end up with paint everywhere. <laughs> Move everything out of the way. Let's see. Ooh. Ah. Okay, well, it's because it wasn't a very level playing field. <laughs> it really is. Okay, um, what to do with this? This is the question. Okay, well, first of all, uh, I might blow a little bit and see what happens with that.
not sure if the paint was a bit thick actually. Or maybe there just wasn't enough. That's the other question. This has gone really nice in terms of the um, the cells though. I'm gonna fire it up a bit, see what happens, see if it bursts some bubbles. And um, quite an interesting, I might spin it again. Quite interesting, I think. It's very unusual for me. It's not my um, usual look. I thought I'd try and do a few that were a bit kind of different to the ones that I've been creating. A lot of the ones look fairly straight. Ah! <laughs> it's going all over the walls. Fairly similar. And my hands. Oh, that's, that's quite pretty. Um, <laughs> it's messy and fun. I quite like it. I might leave it like that, actually. So... Um, I'm just going to try and, I don't know, um, <laughs> I'll bring you in for a close up. It is a little bit muddy, I think. I think people would be able to say uh, without too much, I don't know, hands up, yeah, a bit muddy, but quite pretty actually um, when you get, get to it. So, um, right, I'll bring you in for a close up. Okay, so here comes the close up. Um, oh, here's the uh, oops, a wobbly table, the little pine cone. It's actually quite cute. I might put a bit of glitter on it to make it a bit more Christmassy. But it's quite a lot of detail on it, actually. And then we go over to the uh, record, album, vinyl. I don't know what to call it ever. And I think I could have done with maybe some kind of brighter colours. I forgot to put the black in. I was going to put some black in. What a mess. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I mean, some really, really pretty cells. This is a really lovely piece over here, look. I think that kind of gold went with the orange and kind of blended really nicely. So this side is much brighter. Um, I really like it, actually. It's quite unusual. Again, very different colours for me, but quite fun. Very messy. So yeah, thank you for watching. Thanks for following thanks for subscribing thanks for sharing you're so wonderful and um i'll see you soon okay take care lots of love bye bye